One of the major reasons for that was the sunstone, this mythical stone that allowed them to always know the position of the sun, even in cloudy skies or after the sunset. Now, Norse mythology is full of all kinds of rad things, like giant wolves and serpents that keep the world in place. But scientists had a feeling that sunstones might actually be real, and even how they might work. And now, we've actually found one. Scientists found some calcite crystal in the remains of a British ship that sank in 1592. It was sitting in the wreckage with some other navigational equipment, so they figured, hey, this is probably a sunstone. And the sailors most likely used it as a backup for when their compasses wigged out, because early compasses, you guys not the greatest. So the crystal they found was a type called Iceland Spar, and it had been weathered over the years by the ocean, but they used a similar stone to test their theory. And they were able to use it to find the direction of the sun within one degree margin of error, even in a cloudy sky, even when the sun dipped below the horizon. So how does it work? What is this Viking magic? It is polarization. Light travels in a specific direction, and even when you can't see the sun, the light from it forms these concentric rings with the sun at the center. Calcite, like Iceland spar, actually depolarizes light that goes through it and splits it. So you draw a dot on top of it and it'll be projected onto two sides on the bottom, making two more dots. And if you rotate the crystal until those two projected dots are the same color and intensity, whichever way the top side is facing is where the sun is. Viking magic just like that. Now scientists were pretty sure that this was how sunstones worked, but actually finding one in a ship with other similar tools means we pretty much know for sure now. And you know, the sunstone isn't very far off from how some migratory birds keep their directions straight. They can actually see polarized light patterns in the sky and then use them to calibrate their magnetic senses. God, birds are creepy. It's kind of awesome to think that even back then, unknowingly, we were using biomimicry to give us the advantages that animals have. You can get Icelandic spar really cheaply online if you want to make your own sunstone at home. Let me know if you do, or if you know of any other ancient survival skills down below, and subscribe for more D-News.